I found this little lizard guy, and I didn't know he would just jump right up in my hand, and then he started to crawl up my arm. He seemed friendly enough, a uh, little guy. Well, I like lizards around. Uh, I, I was real careful not to hurt him and all. So I figured I'd, I'd let him go about his business. Moved up against this pole here. I thought maybe he'd jump up on that. and But instead, he kind of hung around a little longer and, and actually stayed in my hand for a little bit. And it kind of surprised me that uh, he took a little taste there on the end of my finger and that oh, interesting. I guess he wanted to see if that was anything he'd be interested. So I gently let him go. That was kind of neat. Not too long afterwards, I seen the uh, wasp here found himself what looks like uh, a worm, you know, the kind of worm that you'd find on a, underneath a leaf or something. Well, it was big, so obviously uh, it was too heavy for him to pick up and fly with it. So he struggled with walking it to wherever it was he was going. So I decided to follow him for a little bit, see if it would lead me to his nest. Yeah, that... that <laughs> That must be three times the size of that little wasp, as far as weight-wise. Yeah, you can definitely see he's struggling to get wherever it is he's trying to get to, probably his nest. But uh, I don't want to wait that long to find out where it was, so I'm going to leave him here.